What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Mike Rich, man. What's happening with y'all today? I hope everybody, each and every last one of y'all, is having a blessed day today. Uh, today is Sunday. Happy Sunday to everybody. Hope y'all getting a good little day off before you go back to work. No football this Sunday, but you can tune in to my videos and hang with me on Sunday. You feel me? Yesterday, I went to the biggest mall in Georgia, and it's called the Mall of Georgia, and I feel like I walked through an amusement park. This is zero cap. That mall is huge, and it's only three, like, really... Uh, good shoe stores in it. I mean, they don't have no snipes, no DTLR, none of the urban sneaker stores are in there. And uh, my wife was telling me that it's made by the same people that make a lot of these big outdoor outlets and stuff like that. And it felt very outletish in that mall. So I don't know. Y'all give me y'all opinion on the stuff I did show, but it was way too many people in there. I could barely vlog. I was like, I really prefer to just stay in my regular malls I go to because that mall had way too much going on but I'm gonna let y'all check that vlog out and I did make a purchase at that mall and I'll let y'all check these out at the end of the video after the vlog man so anyway hope everybody having a good one enjoy the vlog and yeah let's do it so this mall is huge I'm talking about Floors on top of floors with floors on it. Feel me? Why? Why does this mall need to be this big? Mm. Now we're approaching Foot Locker, House of Hoops, Mall of Georgia. Where there's so many people in here, it's legit like at an amusement park in here, guy. Bro, they legit got their whole stock room back here, Shadow. How they run out of room in the stock room? And they got their whole stock room in the back. It's all right. And here we have today's release. The Air Jordan 6 Cool Gray. It's cool right here. Get it? Cool Gray? Cool. Just dropped today. What I will say is the white leather is super buttery on these guys, bro. I ain't mad at them. I went cop simply because I don't need this shoe. But they are clean, though. I ain't going to lie. You like them? But I ain't mad at these at all, bro. Like, I really like the leather on them. I like the suede, the paint job on them. Like, I really like the little glossy gray going on in the back as well, the air. These hard, man. Like, the just being a wearable, simple shoe to rock in, like, the springtime or something like that. I actually mess with these heavy. I like. I usually don't like the two grays, but the fact that the midsole gray and the gray on the heel is different from the gray on the, um, on the front and on the toe box. I just, it just really blends in perfect to me. Only thing about it is I just really don't need this shoe at all. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot more Jordan 6's I'd rather have than these right here. Y'all comment below and tell me what y'all think about these. Clean, clean. Hey, Shane. Boy, what these is, Adidas? Woo, what these is? D-Track can water, boy, what the hell is going on? But these shoes doing everything and nothing all at once, boy, nothing. This thing called Agent Gill Rest Mod. I don't even know what the hell that means, bro. That Gilbert Arenas or something, boy, what these is? They got another one down here. Boy, just when you thought it couldn't get any worse. Boy, what these is, shawty? They gotta be Gilbert, man, Gilbert Arenas. Gilchrist, I don't know what it is, but track can water, boy. Hell no, bro. They look like a snake trying to get out of prison or something. I don't, I don't know what the hell these is, it, boy. Track can. I ain't need a Kobe guy. They look like the Kobe. I ain't need a Kobe guy. On my tripping. Spaceship shoes. What are you talking about? Sports action. The music was extremely loud in Foot Locker, so let me see if it's bad in here, cause that about to drive me insane. Got the Army Green Air Max 95, these hard, boy. Hey, man, I feel like I don't see any, oh, they messed it up. The swooshes. They messed it up with all them little hidden swooshes all. Just leave it, man, bro. Sometimes simple is better, bro. I like the blue ones. That same thing with the swooshes, though. All of them, all these little JD Sport exclusives got little swooshes hidden there, bro. And this one hard. My wife got some on real similar to these right now. These hard right here, I ain't mad at them. These look like yours, man. These are the animal print ones I saw in the outlet. Yeah, not really a fan. These are kind of dope right here. Colorway hard. Got some wheat vibes going. And I don't like the lasers, but we got to switch them guys out. 
boy, what are these in Nike? Oof, these in KDs or something? Boy, these, woo, these trash, boy. KD Trey 5. I remember when the Trey 5 used to be slick dope back in the day. These is terrible. Power Ranger shoe. What yeah, you talking about? These should come with a sword or something. No, Sarsky. What that button do? It don't make them no better, that for sure. And they got the uh, the dope suede uh, black and gold questions on sale for 110 You know what I'm saying? This way should have been on the whole shoe, though. They should have just left their leather. That shiny, it's good leather. They should have left it alone and put this suede on the whole shoe, though. That would have that had it real proper light, you feel me? It's a little dunk action. A little light blue colorway with the uh, kind of like cell swoosh on them. I ain't mad at them. Super clean. Head as you saying. Got the burgundy guy. Right here. Just do it. Oh, look at that. Gold, whatever the hell going on right here. Say, so just do it. Little Nike sell vintage out. You know what I'm saying? Hey, my wife is finna get these right here. They clean. You sure you want them? Today? Uh, I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. We get it. All the questions. No answers, just questions. Hey, you talking about Denver Nugget colorway, Laker guy, Kobe things. Got the blue uh, uh, classics and got the like Concord vibes on the lows. Fat as hell, but it's all good because they classics, man. 90s vibe. Yeah, man. So that was the Mall of Georgia. Like I said, it was a bunch of loud music, a bunch of people in there. It was a couple of times I was like, you know what? Um, let's just go. Let's get. Because, I mean, you just, I mean, from one end of the mall to the next, it's such, so much walking. And it's so much stuff around the outside of that mall. It's just like a really, really busy area. So, uh, Buford, Georgia, Mall of Georgia. For sneakers, if you want to go in and get out, go in there and get your shoes and come back out, that might not be your best choice if you um, come to Georgia and you want to go to a mall. Anyway, let's go ahead and get to the pickup I got. I did get. Uh, the shoe that my wife wanted in the video. She did want those uh, Jordan 1 Low um, crafts, the brown ones, but I told her she'd probably be able to find those later on for under retail or at the outlets or something like that. Just my opinion from my experience going back and forth with certain shoes. This one, however, I didn't I didn't think she would be able to find later on at an outlet. I just, I was like, go ahead, if you gotta choose between the two, go ahead and get that one. She was gonna buy both, but I was like, just wait on the Jordans, go ahead and get these right here. And this is the Women's Nike Dunk Low SE. Um, she did try the shoe on, so that's that try it on shoe right there. And I don't, honestly, I still don't know the history behind this shoe. I think it's just, because it just says, just do it on here. And it got a lot of Nike stuff on there. But there's the shoe. You know what I'm saying? It's a dope color. And I told her, I said, get, she tried it on and it looked super dope on her feet. And I was like, get the Dunk Lows. Get the maroon, burgundy colored Dunk Lows. Because they clean. Nike stitch black on the back. I like the fact that they got that. Y'all know I like the vintage. I know a lot of people like, I'm tired of the vintage. But I like the vintage, man. The vintage that mid so this, these, it makes these shoes pop. It brings the shoes out. And so sneakers like this, I put vintage laces in them, man. I just put the vintage out. Um, that color, <laughs> whatever, call it old. That, that that color gonna be called old. You're gonna put that on the um, in the laces. But um, got Nike just do it. Like I, I showed it in the store, y'all saw it. Um, when I showed it in the store, like I said, I don't know what this commemorates anything or anything like that. But uh, I told wifey, I would I, if I were her, was her, I think you should go in there and get these because you, this shoe right here is going to sell out. And when it sell out, it's going to be gone. You ain't going to see it no more. Uh, dope shoe, in my humble opinion. Sometimes I don't like when they go crazy with all the Nike branding. But the colorway and the, like like I said, the midsole being that little vintage look. And then the outsole, actually, I mean the upper, actually having this kind of like texture on it. Y'all probably won't be able to see it on the camera. But it got, kind of got like this. You, you definitely probably can't tell. But it's like this textured look is on the... Uh, toe box as well it's not like flat but it's, it's just like a good dope quality shoe and i'm pretty sure like with this color man you could just it's very wearable you can drip this with a lot of different uh looks you know what i'm saying so anyway that's what we bought these were like 120 dollars or something like that um dopeness they had them in my size 13 and a half i probably got them for myself although i would take that little gold look 
hit out of the laces. I'm not really a big fan of that. That's doing a little bit too much to the kids. You feel me? But um, that's it, man. Y'all comment below tell me what y'all thought of the Mall of Georgia. Mall of Georgia. A little bit too busy for my taste, especially on a Saturday. I ain't trying to do it no more. You feel me? <laughs> I go up there on a random Tuesday or something if I do go up there. Y'all hit a thumbs up. Like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already, hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation, stand all the way up to the moon on them, and keep watching my video, cause that's what I'm here for. Gone.